Nobody fully understands the effect lightning has on its victims. But strange things seem to happen. front of me right here. Steve, people of Underground Arts, thank you so much for bringing these specimens to me. All right, all right, are you going to introduce us or what? Ladies and gentlemen, it's a special, special, special moment now because I want to present to you, it's been a long time. It's been a while. It's been a minute. It has been. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to play a song right now that features a solo from a very special, special piece of Earth technology. That's right, a piece of Earth technology you might remember, those of you that were born earlier in time. You might recall a dot matrix printer known as the Image Writer 2. That's right, put your hands together for the Image Writer 2. That's right. Yes, only here, only tonight will you see this. This is not happening anywhere else on the planet. I can guarantee you that. There's no other place that this is happening. But tonight, a simple text file. That's right. A simple text file is going to be performed. How many people know this song? You sad motherfuckers. That's right. Can I get a show of hands for the LC2? Come on now. Can I get a show of hands for the LC2? These are not ladies apple people by by the sound of it. Okay, first of all I think I got inadvertently sent to print when the printer. First of all, this works about forty percent of the time. How many 
people think Coco can get it working? Say, raise your hand. Say, raise your hand. No, say, raise your hand. How many people think it's not going to work? Say, don't raise your hand. Okay. Okay, so he's going to start. Control P. Start. He's going to do this right. Hey, it's going. Do you have to start it over? You said they have to wait the whole song before we start again? Hold on while we let the printer walk out to Saga's uh, tonight. We're on the wheels and we'll be right back. Come on. It's Saturday night. It's Saturday night. You got nothing better to do. You can wait. Did here. someone just say get this shit over with? I'm gonna be late for work. See? That's right. It would not be the first time you waited on a dot matrix printer if I know you. If, and I can tell by the look in your eye that you have waited a long time for this. And I'm, you, gonna, you know, the only, I'm gonna make sure you get what you're here for. Yeah, the only business that still uses dot matrix printers? Yeah, budget rent a car. <laughs> they still use dot matrix printers. So every time. What the fuck? I'm in a car, I think hey, hey Co Coco, I think you're up. Your printer's getting fucking heckled. <laughs> Are you ready? All right, now here's the deal. You gotta be really damn quiet because this is kind of like seriously, like this is crucial. Man or Astro Man unplugged. This is like Kool Aid's and Cookie nap time. Gotta be quiet. I have to tell you. And that's, I'm starting a new rule tonight, guys. When the printer doesn't work well, and that's all Coco's thing, because he spent four days and we had to stop recording a record so he could do that. Uh, I get to tell something really embarrassing about our youth, about Coco, if it fucks up. Is that okay with you guys? Okay, here's mine for tonight. In 1992, we practiced in a trailer on a cattle ranch in Auburn, Alabama. We, we paid... $70 a month to practice in this trailer. And one day, Coco shows up to practice and says, Guys! I've seen the future. We've got to fucking do this. It's a CD-ROM. And tell them what CD-ROM you brought to practice, Coco. I know what you're trying to do here. It was but it was, in fact... It was Billy Idol's cyberpunk record on CD. And it came with an extra CD-ROM. And he said, that's where the future is going. <laughs> that was some William Gibson shit right there, man. Are you kidding me? That was some burning chrome. All right, in that break, we lost a few guitar pedals here. But it's, it's going to be OK. Did I do that? No, no. I, maybe, yes, you did. Okay. <laughs> of course I did. <laughs> Oh, 
When word of this event is heard all around your so-called world, I shall issue an ultimatum which will bring it to its knees, subject to the rule of Draco. Well, I know water won't affect him, but I'm making myself into a fire extinguisher, and let's see how he likes this dose of carbon dioxide!
concerned. But the reality is, is that we do not, it's not that we do not, but we cannot take requests. You understand that this has all been pre-programmed like eons ago. Oh, you were just, heck, oh, just preferences. I like that. Yes, Earth user preferences. I like it. Noted. <laughs>